one thing that I want to point out uh, before we uh, move on is that uh, even though you can do a lot of changes from this uh, front end uh, there is there's another way where you can make changes if you know uh, HTML and CSS and that is under the appearance if you go to editor then you can get access to the complete CSS file for example the background color that I was just about to change I can change it from here or I can change it from within the uh, control panel that was provided uh, for us so you can change a lot of you have so many options to change it if you don't know anything about CSS then I suggest you leave this place alone you don't want to mess around with it um, before you make any changes always copy this uh, whole section and place it in a text file so that if you make a mistake you can always go back and uh, uh, redo your uh, redo the changes that you've made so um, in order to get uh, color uh, because sometimes you don't know um, uh, the HTML color codes that you need so what you can do is you can type HTML color codes into Google color codes and uh, this will give you um, it will give you something like this so what, what you do is uh, if you click on any color that you see it will give you the code for that color so for example I'm looking for a dark blue and uh, the dark blue I'm looking for is actually none of this but uh, you get the idea so or you can actually slide uh, and create your own color that you think you like then once you satisfied with it you can uh, you can click anywhere bit uh, inside this uh, box and it's going to give you the color code here so what I've done is I've actually um, look for the perfect color codes that I, I want and now I'm going to uh, go I can either I think I, I, I can change it from here or I can change it from here let me show you if you go to the basic style settings I can body background color I can paste it here which is the one I've already copied let me paste it as you can see this is the dark blue color that I need so if I click on save changes if we go to our website now and refresh it we'll say that uh, we'll get a dark blue background color to match the blue um, headers which is perfect this is how I like it and uh, this is how you modify this so you can uh, uh, use this color codes to get a perfect color that you need and then copy it and you know use it to modify the website as uh, uh, let me show you actually I'll show you that later because uh, there are so different websites that are also created and I modify all the colors around so I just want to show you the color combination but I'll show you in the future videos so the next thing for us to change now uh, is this uh, navigation bar as you can see it's still gray and I want it to be blue as well and I want it to match the other so this is the thing that we're going to be changing next and I'll see you in the next video thank you